Not any particulars. They have no pulse, they have blue in color and stuff like that. So you can have the lady where they are. Now just like any human, the landmark is the same between the knuckles. Okay? So you take your two fingers and you go in the center of the chest, just like how you do CPR, and you compress the chest. The rate is still the same, does not change. Okay? So you push down hard and fast, ensure full chest recall, minimize interruptions. And then remember the baby's life, baby wherever you need to go. So if you need to push the phone to make a call to the police, to the police or to the ambulance, you can call them while you're doing CPR or someone can drive you to the hospital while you're doing it. So there's two fingers in the center of the chest and you push down hard, the same place, okay? For, ch for children, this is it's a bit different with the hand, okay? So for the, for children, just say they're about 13 years old, 14 years old, and they're small in both. Instead of using two hands, you would use one hand. So they will lie down over here or on the floor, so instead of interlocking your both your hands for adults, you're going to use one hand, your dominant hand, across the chest. You can use this for support, and you go down like that. And the same rate, 30 to 2. Keep going, right? Remember your whole process, right? You have to call for help as well, and keep going. You do not want to do this. Bend your arm and do it like that. You'll get very, very tired and then you won't do proper CPR that way. You have to keep your arms over the patient, your body has to come over and push down that way. That's for a child, for an infant, it's two fingers, push down the center of the chest and directly down, like that. Okay, any more questions guys? Anyone?